Right, this may be the last video I take of my birds. A little bantam, Americana, called Americana, sweet bird, older bird, very healthy. My younger silkies and showgirls, the ones with the naked necks, they're supposed to have that. Those are the showgirls, like Vegas showgirls. A little grab ass there. When I lose a bird, that's usually what it's due to. I can't remember the last time I had a sick bird here. Uh, there's some babies running around with the moms. And he's in here. Oh, come on, sweetheart, you want to come in? Come on in. Come on, who's coming in? And they all come running. They all come running in. Make it easier to put them down tomorrow. This sucks. I know, I know. Um, in here, it's a hot day out, but no silkies and showgirls. I know, babies, I know. Those are my geese. I do have five peacocks isolated in here because they were being picked on by my others, but they're fine in here together with the other birds. Peahen there. She's healthy, just scab on her neck from being beat up. Now she's here. Bunch of baby Sebastopol geese. My babies! What are you doing, huh? I know, I feel like I'm deceiving you. I lied to you, I know. I'm sorry. I am so sorry. I made promises to you guys, I know. I know. Okay, assholes. Oh. Oh, dear, that's a fan going in the background just to cool it down a little bit in the corner. Um, I'm crushed. I'll lock them up later. They were positive once again. I would understand putting them down. But they came back negative, every single one of them. These are my peacocks now that they will plan on putting down. And yeah, I have. Some little brucellosis, which knocks me on my ass, but I moved here from Long Island. Basically, because I wanted to be happier. And I thought this was the right place to do it, but <laughs> you gotta think that through again. Um, if I don't have birds, the move will be a lot easier. Um, it's hot out, so you're gonna see a couple of them panting. A little chasing going on because they're breeding, so. What's up, babies? I know. I'm not catching one of you tomorrow. I want you to beat the fuck out of anybody grabbing you, okay? Alright, you got that? Take the rise out. I know, I could do it nice and easily, but I'm not. Yep. You got a couple of scratches, but... They're killing you. They're gonna hurt you anyway, so you know what? Beat the fuck out of them. say that because the people who've been here really have been nice they're doing their jobs and I get that right, this one over here India blue white eyed hen a little bit of the spalding blood going on with her the tighter crest it's a little bit larger in size you can see the white speckling going on there that means if she's bred with a white boy she will produce white eyed offspring and the boys would show the white eyes in the tail that's what they meant by white eye. There's one of my opal black shoulder boys. He's the older one. Just coming in. Next year he's going to be absolutely gorgeous. Well, he would have been. Um, I can't believe this is happening. I really can't believe this is happening. It's a combination of anger and... Guys, if you tested positive, I'd understand. But you're not. You're negative, right, I? This is my Igor. He's my baby. He's an Indian blue black shoulder. <coughs> yeah, yeah. The next six eggs that are laid tonight, eight eggs. Once again, those will be turned over, which I don't mind doing the eggs. It's just ridiculous. All my other baby geese over here, ten of them. 
How's my little monsters doing, huh? There's the foster dads. My baby's okay, huh? Run for the hills. Run for the hills. Come on. I know. <laughs> you got it. I'm not going to make this easy on them. Not at all. And trailer geese wandering into the pea barn. More storage area in here. Right. Everything outside that you saw and every little listen here, these are changes I did to basically make sure my peacocks had a happy home. Hold on, sweetheart. Come here. There's a hen. She's getting ready to lay her eggs. When the wings hang low like that, that's just letting me know that they're getting ready to lay. Yes. Purple silver pie boy. White boy. I know. I'm putting you out there. I'm sorry, babe. You don't have to go out. I just want to take a picture of everybody from in here. You're ready to drop that egg, huh? Babies, I'm gonna miss you. I am gonna have to move. I'm not gonna be able to fucking stay here, you know that? Uh huh. I had to move from the last place because it didn't feel like home anymore. And this, without you guys, is not going to be home either. I am not agreeing to this. And if it happens, I'm gonna sue everybody's ass I possibly can. You're healthy birds, I know. I know. I know. It's hot out. You're allowed to pant. I'm getting out of your way so you come in and lay an egg. Alright? Goodbye, babies. I'll miss you. I'll miss you. There's two eggs right there. Two more to be crushed. Or tested, which will be negative. Which is just fucking acid. I'm they should all be ashamed of themselves. There's a cat, you might want to put her down too. This is the area where the geese stay at night. During the day they roam the property. They don't go anywhere. They'll stay where they belong. A couple of hens on eggs in there, maybe. Bigger guys. And that's the outside of the first cage that we went into. I accidentally ran water here for way too long earlier. I got distracted counting birds and eggs that are going to be destroyed. My babies, what are you doing, huh? How are you? What's up? I know. I know. I'm sorry. That's all I can say is I'm sorry. You put your trust in me and I failed. And it sucks. It really sucks. Uh oh, peacocks out. Uh oh.